I'm located in Lancashire, England. Yeah, I'm from Gothenburg in Sweden. I'm from uh, Tri Cities, Washington. Not Washington, D.C., but the other one with the space. You must, you must say that all the time. You <laughs> yeah. must go the less Washington. relevant yeah. Washington. <laughs> Not the actual. The bigger, less relevant the Washington. Washington. This is Seattle one. <laughs> and I'm from uh, London. Everyone knows London, repping London. <laughs> How was the flight coming in from London? Um, uh, it was, it was okay. It, we had a bit of a kerfuffle at the beginning, but it was it was okay. I don't know. It was just like long. It was just so tiresome. Really long, like yeah. after the first five hours, we we're like, oh, we're not even halfway. <laughs> uh, so we spent about oh, a month straight trying to find the band name, and it was it was like the hardest thing we ever had to do. And like every yeah, single shit. name so that we actually thought names. was half decent was already taken. Oh, so so many bad names yeah. and so many taken names, <laughs> and then we had like the word Atlantic and we all kind of like liked that we yeah. like, I mean, that was obviously taken the name Atlantic so it was like over Atlantic and we were like oh that's so sick and it, it, it kind of makes sense as well because the thing separating all of us yeah. is the Atlantic City so it's, it's perfect for us like like a boy rock. band version of Cindy Lauper <laughs> who? what? what? you've never nah. heard of Cindy Lauper? No, I wouldn't I say that too. I think this <laughs> These three Same months are what we're trying to work out what our sound is like. Mm. But I think yeah. we've got a rough basis, which is a good yeah. start. I yeah. think we won't know completely until like, we're all in a room together jamming. Uh, that's yeah. why I'm excited about Trevor because he's got such a like cool, like American sounding sa like sound to him. Mm -hmm. I think that could bring so much like diversity to the band. As well as the Metro Green Line and So as soon as we um, got off the flight, the very, very long flight we had, um, we got back to the house, meeted everybody, um, meet the guy from the other band who were living here. They're such nice guys, so so grateful to be living with the guys we're living with. And um, we had to get an early night. As soon as, we, as soon as we got back, we just crashed. And then we woke up, beautiful California weather, which was incredible. And um, we just thought, first day, get straight into it, get in the room. Um, set all our equipment up, which took about two hours. That was that was quite cool to kind of get our basis um, with all our equipment and stuff. And we started rehearsing. It sounded good, but it was just like it was so hot. It was like 100 degrees, and we were just trying to get like sounds out and things like that. And it was it was it was it sounded really cool, but I think we just needed to get out there before we all started passing out. And like it was just so so hot. So we so we decided to sit down, get a few acoustic guitars, have a little jam, have a little session, and. Um, we wanted to get a cover out. We want to get a cover out as soon as possible. So um, we started going through songs. See what's in the charts at the moment, and we came across a song "Treat You Better" by Shawn Mendes, and we absolutely like loved that song as soon as we heard it. So we just got out the guitars. Liam started playing some cool riffs and things. It just it was just so sick and it was just so fresh. So like we have to record this, and then within within an hour of just learning like the lyrics and things like that, got straight in like um, got straight in the booth, straight in like. Um, recording everything, recording the guitars, the vocals, the harmonies, and we just got like a rough, rough demo of the track, and then just started um, building it. We want to build it in the next few days and get a sick cover for all you guys.